Hello there folks, I'm Dan Brown from Sort of Interesting and today it's just after 6am at the start of December and you're joining me for a beautiful early morning canal walk here on the Pontcusafli Aqueduct on the Clangothlin Canal and being 6am in December, not only is it very dark but it is also extremely chilly not sure if you can see that everything here is uh, covered in a good coating of ice I'll uh, hopefully get some footage on screen of the boats all frozen up in the basin. Don't worry, they're only holiday boats. When I was out here filming the frozen boats last year, people thought that there were actually people living on them, and I was here shouting and shining lights in their windows in the small hours. So, amazingly, a year ago to this almost very minute, I stood in this exact spot saying that I decided to bring back 6am canal walks into my life. Sorry, I've got to change my hands here and try and keep myself in shots because it is so cold, I can't even with my gloves keep my hands out in front of me too long. Sorry for the change in audio, my friends, but I think I've learnt my lesson that filming with a selfie stick out in the freezing cold on a narrow aqueduct path may not have been the best scenario for creating a quality video this morning. So, as I was saying, amazingly, a year of life experience of fun, games, laughter and tragedy has already passed by since I declared that I was going to start doing my 6am canal walks as a regular thing and here I am still out there still doing these things. I've of course been through various phases throughout the year, through the summer when obviously you've got a lot lighter mornings and a lot warmer temperatures. I was actually getting up and going out at 5am for a period and then I've also tried phases of going out late and waking up later but going out final thing at midnight maybe one maybe even 2 a.m sometimes and walking out amongst nature or along the canal but i definitely think that that 5 to 6 a.m walking is the sweet spot and it's something that i think if you're able to get up and have free time and go out early and be out and about before the world is waking up, it's it's just fantastic and you feel, or I feel at least, like I've got bonus hours, I've got an extra head start on the entire world somehow. Now of course, depending on what you do for work or how your hours are set up, maybe it's not entirely possible. But I think part of my love of doing this goes back to when I had to cycle in everywhere on my little pedal bike from my boat. So I'd be starting work at say nine o'clock in the morning and of course depending where the boat was before I had a car I had to literally wake up, dust the ice off my bike seat sometimes and then pedal in. So I was finding that even though it was sometimes extremely hard going and extremely cold on my face and my fingers cycling along, it did lead to these beautiful moments where I was having this entire sort of natural otherworldly experience and then starting my day. So before I even got to work, I felt like I'd already enjoyed some time of my day and I just cannot, cannot praise that sort of stuff enough. Anyway, I think I'm just going to leave this as a really short, simple vlog of nice morning scenery and a clip from me out still being a fool, walking in potentially dangerous places while there's no one else around. Until the next time, my friends, check the links in the description and I've got a lot more videos coming over December. Thank you for everything. Keep it interesting. Keep it boatworthy. Have a fantastic day. And of course, farewell.